Hi, I'm Scored Poison, and welcome to Project Zomboid. I decided I wanted to do a a series on on this because I'll tell you what, it's an awesome game, and it's it's an early access game, so they're adding a lot of new things. This is probably one of the most in-depth zombie apocalypse simulator I call it uh, that I've seen. You can you can just do a ton of things in here, and as I said, it's in early access, so they're still adding new things to it. But uh, let's see if it let's see if it runs good um, with the uh, with the streaming streaming um, software going on as well. I am going to go to um, the sandbox, um, and that way I'm going to make a new one, <clears throat> and that way I can kind of. Um, to craft the zombies my way because I don't I don't like the running zombies I've never been a fan of those um, so we're gonna let's and I'll do West Point I have a little bit of knowledge um, of West Point I'm kind of really new to the game I think I've only played about ten hours on it so there's a, still some things that I'm learning you may see me check the wiki because I am not by any means a professional. Uh, so zombies, I'm actually going to do normal. I did light. I don't know why you do none. I did low, and I think... Let's do... Should we do normal or high? Eh, hell with it. Let's do high. Um... Oh, one second. And we're back. If you hear that noise, that means somebody's, um... Texting me on Skype. So... Alright, survivors, right now they don't have the survivors, um, in the activated, so basically you're the only one. So, let's see. Urban focused. Yep, that means either, I'm assuming that means either they're all around the big areas, because there's, like, parts of the town that are huge, or they're uniform across the whole board. I'm gonna do that again. That makes it a little bit harder to get into huge office buildings or whatever. Uh, day length, I found out the two real-time hours is a good day length. One hour makes the day and night transition go so quickly. Um, but two, two hours, um, two hours do it pretty slowly. I've got a cat that's just looking like it's wanting to jump up and cause chaos. And I'm trying to wave it away. But it's looking at me like it doesn't know what that means. So I'm, I'm a little distracted. Um, start month. Let's start month in March. That is my birthday. So we shall start there. Start time 9 a.m. is fine. Water shut off. I wish they would say never. I'm going to do 0 to 5 years. See, the story, as far as I understand it, is they've quarantined. They've quarantined um, these two cities. And I'm going to be playing in the one. They've quarantined these two cities. And I... So I don't know why they'd ever shut the water off. <laughs> like, or the, the, the electricity off. I don't know if they do that in a situation where they've quarantined. Loot rarity, I'm going to say abundant. The reason I'm saying abundant for this is... If you were to walk into anyone's house right now... And you opened a dresser... Or you looked on the top of a bookshelf... You would find so much stuff. Like, and I think realistically that's how it would be. Is you would just find. And really, like, most of the time when I played before, I'd leave my house. And then I'd come back just crawling because I was so overburdened. Now I'm a little bit smarter when it comes to that. But it's still this game. I'll tell you what, this game is like a, um... Uh, adventure game, Kleptomaniac's Dream, because you just, just so much stuff you can pick up. And so you go to the first bookcase, and you just, you just throw it all on yourself, and before you know it, you can barely move, you can't run, you can barely swing, I mean, it's just, ah, I want everything, you know? Alright, as for zombies, <clears throat> I'm going to do Shamblers, um, Strength, Weak, Toughness, fragile. Um, I don't want transmission. If I'm gonna die, I just want to die. <laughs> Morality, animation time, cognition, navigate. Yep, they can navigate. Memory, short. I'm not sure. I think the memory is seeing you. 
I'm, I'm not sure. I usually kill any walker that sees me. I don't, I don't like decomposition slows. Uh -huh. Poor eyesight, hearing, and smell. <laughs> I woke up like an hour ago. So there we go. So let's see how well uh, this plays. Oh, that's right. I have to do all this too. I am going to do hmm. Not female or male. Now yeah, let's do male. I'm gonna make him scorp. Hmm. Poison <laughs> and then skin color. Um oh they used to just have a they used to just have a slider. Chest hair, no stubble hair. Hair type. Oh, they added that too. Bald spot like a monk. Recede. No hair. That's kind of close to reality. Oh, and I don't need to worry about the color then. Beard type. Full. <laughs> What's funny is this is how you see a character, so it's funny that they would even bother putting... Like that, you can barely, you can barely see, so, anyway, let's do that. I, see, they used to have, like, five different colors, now it's, like, pale or dark. I don't know, you know, they used to have, like, they have down here, they used to have this wide range of colors, and now they have, they have two. That kind of surprises me. Alright, next, this is when you get to, this is what he, he used to be. So, like, the fire officer has a double speed breaking through doors with the axe and a faster axe swing. Which, the axe plays a very important part, but I don't know how important in this case. I just use to cut down trees. And they're harder than heck to find. Marksman has improved gun accuracy, quicker and reload. The park ranger is not affected by harsh weather conditions. Extra orienting ability. Ooh, you know what? I may try that this time. Construction worker is thick-skinned, less chance of scratches or bites breaking the skin, and they're a faster barricader. And the security guard is a night owl. They require little sleep. They stay extra alert even when sleeping. Maybe I do the extra orienting ability. Hmm. I wonder what that is. Yeah, maybe I'll do a park ranger this time. I did, uh, I do security guard normally so I don't have to sleep as much, but maybe I'll do a park ranger this time. Uh, let's see. And then these are the point system. <coughs> um, the red ones are negatives, and then the green ones are positive. You have lucky. Sometimes things just go your way. Hardy appetite. You need to eat more regularly. <coughs> Excuse me. Short-sighted. Smaller view distance. Slower visibility fade. Clumsy. Makes more noise and moving. Resilient, less prone to disease, slower rate of zombification. Um, strong, extra knockback from melee weapons, increased carrying weight. I mean, I should go for that one. Doesn't get drunk easily, is hardened drinker. Overweight is slower running speed, tired from running more easily. Unlucky, what could go wrong for you often does. Feeble, less knockback from melee range, decreased carrying weight. Excuse me, agoraphobic, gets panicked when outdoors. Cowardly, especially prone to becoming panicked. Hard of hearing, smaller perception radius, smaller hearing range. Um, graceful, makes less noise when moving. Light drinker, gets drunk quickly. Hypochondriac, may develop infection symptoms without having been infected. That sounds like a fun one to have. <laughs> uh, brooding, is recovered slower from bad moods. Prone to illness, more prone to disease, faster rate of zombification. Keen hearing, larger perception radius. Athletic, faster running speed, can run for longer without tiring. Short tempered, is quick to anger. Light eater, needs to eat less less regularly. Stout, extra knockback from melee weapons, increased carrying weight. I don't know why they have that and the other strength one. Claustrophobic, gets panicked when indoors. Brave, less prone to becoming panicked. Patient, Less likely to get angry. Weak. Less knockback from melee weapons. Decreased carrying weight. And eagle-eyed. Faster visibility fade. Higher visibility arc. 
<coughs> I may try to go with a go with a um let's see let's take light drinker because I never drink the alcoholic beverages so add trait and then um, smaller for zipping radius agoraphobic yeah most of the time I'm jumping back and forth from buildings but I don't think I want to do that yet so running speed tire from running more easily clumsy makes more noise than moving short-sighted and hearty appetite I'm eating all the time as it is actually what see like evil versus hmm well, let's do, um, no, that would, do, okay, that would give me, yeah, let's go ahead and do, let's do hard of hearing. Smaller hearing range, smaller perception, let's do hard of hearing, let's, actually, you know what, let's do brooding, recover slower from bad moods. That'll give me four, and then I will do, um, stout. Because I tell you what, the carrying, carrying is, is, ugh. <laughs> like, I can carry like eight pounds. Unless that's because I gave myself a weakness I didn't know about. Alright, I'm saying done. So, we'll play a little bit on this one, and then I'll have to break it up. And see about um see about um doing other ones so we'll, i'll get a chance to move around and see if it lags a lot if it doesn't lag a lot you guys will see this video if it doesn't lag a lot you will never see this video <laughs> the music is terrific and the atmosphere is pretty dang good and i've got to say that about about this game it's it's a nice atmosphere this game there too it has no ending so it's just about how you live and die like if I lived to the five years in this game I would just continue with water barrels and whatever whatever when the water shut off and flashlights when the you know the power is out or whatever yeah, I played a little bit on the last one I want to see if if we start in the same place too because if we start in the same place, I thought we started in random locations. If we don't, then I may, um, I may switch cities. Because I know, I know too much about this city. Okay, so this is a little, this is Spiffo. That's their, <laughs> their thing. Um, I'm going to move around. Oh, it doesn't look like, okay, so here I am starting my first. The first thing to do is sneak. Not run. That was first thing to do is sneak over and shut the windows because you want to shut the windows. No, don't smash window. Close curtains. You want to shut the curtains because they can actually see in. So you don't want them to be able to see in. Smash window. Oh, this sucker. Oh, okay. There we go. No, you know what the leg is manageable. Oh, that's the door. Is that a door? Oh, that doesn't have a curtain. I need to get curtains for that. Okay, first thing is go to the bookcase and see. <coughs> bookcase, see, they just have all this stuff. I absolutely love it. Um, but there's no weapons in those. Sneaky, sneaky, sneaky. And then, um, what we're going to do is open these doors. We're going to close all the curtains. Oh, well, i got to stop this video, and then I'll start another one. See y'all in a bit. I'm going to pause this. Boop.